Welcome back. Today I'll be showing you my copies of the Borderlands games. So I'll start with the Borderlands Game of the Year edition for the PS3. Uh, I bought this version because I missed out on just the Borderlands game. Uh, plus the Game of the Year edition has all of the DLCs so it's not a bad buy. So anyway, the Game of the Year edition includes, and I'll show this uh, to you at the back, the Zombie Island of Dr. Ned, Mad Moxie's Underground Underdome Riot, the Secret Armory of General Knox, and Claptrap's New Robot Revolution. Right? So this one here, um, again, it's it's a it's a great and excellent game to play, uh, especially when you play Couch Cop with your friends. Um, not a lot of um, games nowadays have Couch Cop. Um, I mean, they have online cop, but not a lot of Couch Cops. Uh, anyway, there it is. Um, the Game of the Year case right there. Uh, obviously this complete collection uh, of gives you the game itself, the voucher for all the four add-on packs and the fold-out Pandora map which I'll show you uh, in a little bit. Alright, cool. So um, anyway, there's the back. Uh, let's let's open it up. There we go. And obviously you get a few things. Obviously we get the Blu-ray disc right there. And if we take that out, um, there it is. There's the artwork um, on the back of, uh, of it. Uh, there's the disc. Right, and along with the Blu-ray disc, uh, you get several things, obviously, on the left-hand side here. Okay, the first thing you get is obviously the um, Duke Nukem Forever First Access. So there it is, there's a code uh, that allows you first access to the game. Right, and this was way back in, what is it, 20, 2010 maybe, 20, 2009, 2010? So there it is. The second thing that you get is the DLC code to get all of the Borderlands expansion. So there it is uh, for uh, all four uh, expansions. Uh, and there's the back of it, right? And then you get the map of Pandora's East Coast. Uh, so this will show you all of the locations, right? There we are. So let's open that up and show it to you. There we go. So the Pandora's East Coast. So that's, and the legends down here, and it's anywhere from Firestone, Sky Gully, uh, Dull Headland up down uh, up to Wayward Pass right there. This also doubles as a poster. So if we flip this over, there it is. There is the Borderlands poster. All right. Cool. Next up is obviously the manual uh, or instruction manual booklet, whatever you want to call it. So there it is. Uh, and just going through it uh, very quickly. Right, that's the usual there. Uh, you've got the contents uh, setting up uh, the story uh, so far and the four playable characters. Uh, those are the four add-on contents, uh, expansions. Uh, main menu, the ca four characters, Roland, my favorite, the one that I played. Uh, you've got Lilith, Mordecai, and Brick. Uh, all the di different controls for combat, vehicles, etc. Uh, you get the HUD, game screens, inventory, skills, uh, log screen, map screen, what else is here in here, loot, pause menu, options, uh, multiplayer, key Pandorians, uh, and all of the um, developers. And also um, support line and, you know, two pages of notes and uh, there's the back of it. Alright, so there it is. That is the Borderlands Game of the Year uh, edition. All right now, come to think of it, I don't think the first Borderlands had a special edition. So hence why I bought this one. Uh, and, you know, and I guess it's a, it was a wise purchase because I got everything in, in one, uh, one disc, well, in one package without having to spend extras, you know, every so often to get all the different expansions. Alright. Anyway, moving on to the second one. We have Borderlands 2, the Deluxe Vault Edition, Vault Hunter Edition. There it is, right here. Okay, so let me explain to you, before I move on to this um, uh, version, this edition, let me explain to you that besides this one, there is another edition that I wanted, but I missed out. Simply because I forgot to pre-order. Okay. Now, I have missed out on several games because I did not pre-order, this being one of them. Uh, anyway, 
just in case you're wondering, the other version that I wanted is the Ultimate Loot Chest Edition. Alright, uh, right, but I digress, back to this one, inside of this, uh, right, so there it is, before we get to the inside obviously, there is the box, there's the front, right, there is the side, one side shows you what's uh, the contents, you have all these different things, uh, you know, Borderlands, the, the game, the art book, uh, the bobblehead, the stickers, Pan map Pandora, and also the DLCs uh, as well, right. Uh, you also have this side as well, uh, so you can actually display this box in multiple, well, two ways, either have this cover or you can have this cover. It's entirely up to you. Uh, the other side just gives you what's usually printed on the back of the Blu-ray um, disc case, right? There we are, okay? All right, let's open it up and see what is actually inside. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this white filler. Right, there's nothing in there. Uh, it's not a magic trick. There it is. I'm gonna put that on the side. Okay, starting with the game. All right, so here we are. If I pull this out from the box, there we go. There is the game. So in, it it comes inside a sleeve with an embossed logo. I don't know if you can see that, but if I put it on an angle here, there it is. You can see that it's it's embossed. Uh, the Borderlands 2 is embossed. Uh, this is embossed. Right, and um, oh, the side's just the same, but uh, yeah, there you go. It, it comes in this sleeve, this cardboard sleeve. There's the back of it, right? If we uh, take the game out, there it is. There's the game itself, okay? And inside, we obviously get the Blu-ray disc, and if we pull that out, you get a silhouette of um, Hyperion and Handsome Jack. Pretty sure I have that name right. Okay, and on the other side, right there it is, and also you get uh, you get two things in here. Well, well, three, including this. You get the DLC code for the Borderlands 2 Premier Club, which contains the Golden Key, Vault Hunter's Relic, Gearbox Gun Pack, and a new character class. All right, the code's printed in the back. Okay, uh, there is the booklet. Right, it's uh, it's 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 thin. But it gives you all the all the necessary details, you know, controls, getting started playing the game, uh, you know, teammates, etc. Joining, playing co-op, uh, split screen, and all that. And then you've got the support. Uh, you got one page of notes in uh, XCOMs in the back. Okay. So there it is, the game, Borderlands 2. All right. Moving on. Uh, the next thing that I'm going to show you is this one here. This is the Marcus Bobblehead. All right, which is presented, placed inside of the Marcus and Munitions uh, Incorporated uh, vending machine. Okay, there it is. All right, it's the back, uh, nothing bottom. All right, let's take it out. Okay, there we go. And I'm just gonna put this right here on the side, move that back a little bit. So the bobblehead head obviously sits in a plastic mold. So if I take that out, there it is. Okay, there is the Marcus bobblehead. So let's uh, let's kind of zoom in here. Hopefully, I can get this thing corrected. Maybe not. There it is. Okay, that's good enough. There it is. There's uh, it, it's it's quite heavy, so quite a bit of weight to it, which is good, so it doesn't topple over easily. Um, but yeah, there's the bottom. It's uh, it's very nice, nicely made. Don't know if you can hear that, but it's um, it's, it's solid. All right, so let's put this uh, on the back here somewhere. There it is. Okay. Uh, now the rest of it, I'm gonna take it, take them out and show you one by one. So uh, there's quite a few in here. Oh, that's right. Okay. First thing that we have is this. Now at first I thought this was a folded flyer, uh, but these are actually stickers. Let me show you. So if I open these up, boom, there we go. You've got the 2K Games, Gearbox Software, what is that, Minion on board, and the Borderlands logo. These are actually stickers. All right, there it is. You also get, right, the DLC code uh, for Borderlands 2. Now this contains two things, which is the Contraband Skyrocket Grenade and Character Skins and Heads for, uh, for all four uh, players. Okay, there it is. And the code is obviously printed in the back. Alright. 
Now we get to the map. There's also a map of Pandora's northwest coast with all different areas. So let's open it up and I'll show you. Now this one doesn't double as a, as a map. So as you can see, there's a map front. Uh, there's nothing at the back. But anyway, there's a map. There it is. Uh, anywhere from Iridium Blight uh, to Tundra Express, Caustic Caverns, ooh, favorite, uh, Bloodshot Stronghold, Three Horns, uh, you know, Southern Shelf Bay, uh, Thousand Cuts, etc. Okay, Arid Nexus is also on the bottom uh, left there. But that is the map right there. Let's fold this up. And also, next up, and lastly, and finally, we get the art book. Okay. Also with an embossed cover, which is very nice. I love these things. I love these embossed covers. Uh, it just gives it a, a nice look. Uh, anyway, um, inside, right, uh, obviously, you have all the different characters uh, right there. Now, I am holding this on an angle, so bear with me. I'm really sorry about this. Uh, my setup is not that great. Uh, table of contents, uh, you know, characters. Who have we got here? Salvador, the Gunzerker. There it is, and all the different... Um, uh, concept art for him, initial concepts for Salvador. Uh, who's next? We've got Maya the Siren, all different uh, concept art. You've got Axton the Commando, and I'm pretty sure I played as Axton. Uh, I can't remember. It's been a while. There's a Tart. I probably did because of the Tart. Then you've got Zero the Assassin. Uh, Claptrap. Lilith. Roland, Brick, Mordecai. So basically, all of the characters from, uh, well, all the playable characters from the first game is available here as, I believe, as DLs. Uh, no, as NPCs, right? You've got Mad Moxie, uh, Scooter and Marcus, you've got Ellie, the Sheriff, Sir Hammerlock, Tiny Tina, which gets uh, her own spin off. Angel, Handsome Jack, and I think that's it. And then all the wanted posters for all four characters. Yeah, and then you've got all the different equipments. I'm just going to go through these very quickly. You know, Jacobs, Tedior, uh, Bandit, Malawan, Vladov, Tork, Torg, E-Tech. All the legendary weapons. Oh, I didn't know this about this. Uh, these are all the legendary weapons that you can get in-game. There we are. All the different shields that you can get, uh, all the different grenades, the enemies, the bandit technical, huh, buzzard, uh, bully mongs, crystallisk, surveyor. And there they are. All right? Oh, there it is. Gearbox software, circa 2012. Look at that. Those are all the people. Sorry about the um, the glare there. But there we go. That is everything you get um, in Borderlands 2, the um, Vault Hunters uh, edition. Right? Uh, and yeah, that's it. Uh, Borderlands uh, Game of the Year edition and Borderlands 2. Unfortunately, I did not buy Borderlands 3 because I had lost interest in the game. Uh, I guess I would have bought it, but I missed out on the pre-order. So, yeah. Uh, plus, I had to channel my money somewhere else. More important. You know, perks of being an adult with responsibilities and whatever. Anywho, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Ciao!